Hi guys, my name is Imran and in this tutorial series you're going to learn about React. In this video in specific, you will learn about what React is, the concept of virtual DOM, what makes React fast, why should we use it, what are the benefits, etc. So what is React? React is a JavaScript library for building interactive user interfaces. Now, what makes React so fast? To understand that, we need to understand the concept of virtual DOM. And before we begin discussing, I'm assuming you already know what a DOM is. Uh, DOM is basically document object model. It defines the structure of the document. And uh, the browser converts your web page or web document into DOM, which is the representation of this document as an object. And it does that so that it can be manipulated or modified with a scripting language like JavaScript. So what makes React so fast? So let's say we have a DOM tree, like I just shown you the example, okay? So what React will do is, React will make two copies of it, and it'll call it virtual DOM, okay? So this will be a virtual representation of the DOM, but it will create two copies of it, okay? Now, how does it actually work? So whenever anything changes uh, in your application, it gets re-rendered to the virtual representation of the DOM, which means this one. So it made one copy, uh, so it made two copies, and whenever anything changes, it will go ahead and uh, render all the changes to the virtual DOM representation of one of the copies. And then what it's gonna do is gonna compare it with the other copy. It's not gonna compare it with the real DOM, it'll compare with the other copy of the virtual DOM, and it will isolate that change. Okay, so let's say this part has changed. Okay, and it's going to update the real DOM with that change. So why is React so fast? As we know that reading from and writing to the DOM is slow compared to reading or writing from a JavaScript object. Now, virtual DOM is a JavaScript object. So React never reads from the real DOM. What it does is it interacts with the virtual DOM and when it sees the change, it goes ahead and updates the real DOM very efficiently. And that's what makes React really fast. Great. So virtual DOM uh, is basically a JavaScript object that is a virtual representation of the real DOM. So why should we use React? As we discussed, it updates and renders only the elements that changes or updates in the DOM. Hence, it provides you with a quick rendering. Uh, you can build encapsulated components that manage their own state, which we will discuss in future videos, what are components and how they manage their own state. And it can also be rendered on the server using Node and powerful mobile applications using React Native as well. Uh, just a little bit about the history of React. Uh, it was created by Jordan Walk, who's a software engineer at Facebook. It was first deployed on Facebook Newsfeed in 2011 and later on Instagram.com in 2012. And then it was finally open sourced at JS Conference US in May 2013. And Facebook announced a React Fiber uh, in April 2017 as well. And React 360, uh, which is the VR, was released to the public in April 2017. So in the following video, guys, uh, you're going to learn how to set up React application. Uh, and you will also learn about how to set up React application using React, create React app, or if you want to set it up from scratch using Webpack and Babel as well. All right, see you then. Bye.